Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another update for my Panda Palette Challenge. Uh, I have used up a few shadows and some notable mentions over here. So I think we're gonna start off with the ones that I didn't use up, that I only used like once or twice. So let's get started. So if you remember from my Holes Inspired video, I will link that here so you can check it out. I used the Smile Squad, uh, they don't have names. And I also used Blue Moon by Colourpop. Uh, Actually, I want to use this for the whole look, but this one kind of fit better, I don't know. As you can see, there's not much progress at all. Like, I, I rarely use this. Not because I don't like it, but sometimes the pigmentation just isn't there. But nonetheless, it's, it's a very nice quad, you know, I love, I love blue colors. So I think I used this one, the darker one. I also used this one uh, for the wedding that I went to, it's because, you know, match my dress. Okay. Yeah, well, as you can. Hold on. As you can see, this one is barely existent. Almost. Hold on. Yeah, I think there it is. So, I don't really like that shade. It's beautiful, but. It's not performing well, so I don't know what to do with it. I think, man, I don't want to get, I mean, look at this. You see nothing. So I think I'm going to get rid of this as well, because it's just not. And I actually, like I said, I used it for the wedding that I went to, and I used the brush with it, which was probably a mistake, because, you know, if it's not showing up with the finger, how is it supposed to show up with the brush? So I had to go in like four or five times. In order to get that done, um, yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of this as well. So put it into the trash because there's no way anyone will use this. Let me get a baby ball. See what I mean? This way, like the, the finger switches just now. You can barely tell there's anything there. Um, but yeah, so I will get rid of this right now. I will actually write it down as well because otherwise I forget it. Okay, so along with the whole look that I did, I also used Lumi. Oh, wait, hold on. You like this Lumi by Colourpop. Also a very beautiful shade. White with like a like dual chrome bluish purple shimmer. Beautiful, absolutely stunning, but it has glitter in. And oh boy, you will have that glitter all over your face, but it's a stunning shade. God. Look how much more pigment it is than this one, the blue one, and I went over that like Four times, as you saw. It's gorgeous. Oh, look how pretty that is. Oh my god. You know what? I would actually use this as a highlighter as well. Okay, well, this didn't work. I don't have a mirror. Hold on. Okay, that might have been a bit too much. But, okay. Can you see the glitter? Can you see the glitter in this? This is basically what your eyes will look like if you don't have a primer on. Very pretty though. Hmm. So yeah, I'm not really sure what to do with this one yet. I need to play a bit more with this because I, I still have to do a um, pelt bingo with this palette. So maybe I'll just use it there. And then overall just in the inner corner because I don't really want this all over my eyes because that is just it's a mess to remove. But, you know, no progress on this, I just want to show you. Okay, uh, also not much progress on my Makeup Revolution palette. This is again the Flawless Matte. And I've been using Auburn, no, Antique. I mean, it is a bit of progress, I guess. See, there's not that much left. And I've been working on this side over here, then I go around like that. Maybe I can actually finish this palette by the end of the year. How cool would that be? I mean, I'm not in focus now, but look. How cool would that be? If it, you know, if you follow my second Instagram, you would have seen that I downsized my, um, not my makeup collection, but like the storage that I had for my makeup. Uh, I went from like drawer system like this to smaller, and this takes up half of the drawer. It's half. You know, size, you know what I mean. So, yeah, using this up would be actually nice. I'll see. 
And then, last but not least, my Too Faced Chocolate Milk Palette. This is progress. This is amazing. Now, uh, I hit pan on Black Force Truffle, as you probably know, with a, like a dark brown with like pink purple reflex in. It had a bunch of glitter in. I didn't really like it, but over time I actually learned to love it and appreciate it, so that was nice. Uh, but yeah, at just one point I just couldn't deal with this anymore. It looked patchy. It, I mean, I've had this for what, three years, almost four. This year will be four years where I had this. It's getting old. So I figured, you know, I hit pan on it. I had a nice, decent use out of it. I just want to go into it. But it was nice. I actually liked the color. Also, I used up Champagne Truffle. The shimmer shade, finally. Uh, I only use that in my inner corner, so it took me forever to use. But it's completely empty now. There wasn't much left, I think. And also, like, towards the end, it just started to crumble, and I, you know, I'm not gonna sit and repress it. I used to do that, but nowadays I'm just like, no, I just can't be bothered with this. So, that is empty. I actually hit pan on Black Forest Truffle, and then got rid of it. I don't think I had pan in the update before, but now, you look, it's gone now. And then also hit pan on salted caramel. Also, if you hear the wind outside, it's supposed to be like wind up to 130 kilometers an hour, I think. Yeah, it's a storm coming and uh, it, it doesn't look good outside, I can tell you that. Yeah, so yeah, I hit pan on this and now we'll continue to use it. It's, it's a nice, usually people will probably use this as a transition shade. I use it just over my lid underneath then get going. And I have a nice lip going on in white chocolate, which is basically just the blending shade. I don't do anything else. If I don't wear any shadow, actual sh colorful shadow, I use this all over the lid, mascara, done. But yeah, usually it's just for blending. And I actually thought I would hit pan before this update, but I didn't, so sorry. But yeah, that's it, only like four, four more shades to go. Very exciting. Quickly, my goals, use this one up be nice. Uh, hit pan on this one and then once I finish that one you know how I always go with a light shadow, a darker shadow, a light shadow, a darker shadow. Sh sh uh, you know what I mean. I will probably use this one. This is, oh, this, oh, that's a hot pan. Uh, gilded ganache. Ganache, I have no idea said. So that's one. That's dark. And this is salted caramel. Very beautiful shades. It has like like a golden reflex to it. That's something new. You know, I had the purple, blue. Now I have the golden. I can live with it. Then this one will be the last man standing. This is semi sweet. You know, what? I'm gonna give me the swatch of this one. I have dirty fingers right now from all the swatching. Mm. They're actually very pigmented, and I'm happy that the, the last ones that I have left are pigmented because there were some that were not pigmented at all. Like Strawberry Bonbon, the pink shade, that makes absolutely no sense in this palette. No pigmentation whatsoever, so yeah. And then for my Makeup Revolution palette, I really want to use up that one shadow, Antique. Yeah, it's my eyebrow shade, I don't use much, but it will still be nice to use up, right? Um, so that's it. That was the update. It was a lot of work in my Too Faced palette, which I'm happy for, because that's, that's the oldest palette that I have. Let me know what the oldest palette is that you have. This is, I got this in December 2016, you know, around Christmas. So it's been a while. I'm happy once more, because Too Faced is literally Too Faced, if you know what I mean. I will, not, I will not be supporting them anymore. I hope you enjoyed this video. Oh, that brings my, with the small one that I will get rid of, that brings my total to 104 eyeshadows. I don't know if I really counted that correctly. I think, I don't know, I'm not sure. But yeah, 104 shadows. Which is still a lot. Like, my goal was always to be under 100. And then somehow last year I got like four or five new palettes. I don't know how that happened, honestly. But I'm working on it, obviously. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know how your projects are going. Project Pan, Panda Palette, Project 10 Pan, Project Use Up, Project whatever. And I'll see you next video. So I will, oh my god, my hair looks like a mess. This is how I had it on the wedding, and I actually had like curls in. 
they're kind of still there, but you know, didn't put any hairspray in, so it just went south very quickly. Do you hear this? Oh my god. How this how this oh my god, that I had for my makeup? Hold on, this crooked. Um 